Hi everyone, uh, my name is Dr. Miranda Legg and I'm the Interim Director of the Centre for Applied English Studies or CAES. So I'm here today to give you some information about the courses that CAES offers and also the language support services that CAES provides to all Hong Kong U students and students in the Faculty of Arts. Right, to do this I'm just going to share my screen. All right, at CAS, um, our mission is to help you to develop the language skills to be a student of the humanities. And this means developing your academic English skills. So uh, what this means is you need to develop strategies uh, in your time at Hong Kong U uh, for developing your critical reading, writing, speaking and listening skills. So an example of this might be um, how to structure an argument across an academic essay or how to uh, express your own opinion in tutorial discussions. And the way that you'll develop this is by going through an English language learning pathway. So uh, most of you have just come from secondary school where you have focused on developing your general English proficiency with some focus on academic English. When you come to Hong Kong U and the Faculty of Arts, many of you will take a first year course called Core University English. And this will help you develop your English for general academic purposes course. This is one course that is taken, for all, taken by all students in every faculty. Now it's compulsory for level three and level four students and uh, it's optional for level five five star and five star star students. Even though it's optional for those of you who are level five and above, we still recommend that you take it. And the reasons for this are in a video, which I'm going to show you after this presentation. And then after you do that year one course, you'll take a year two course. And this is compulsory for all students. Um, so this is a course that will help you uh, develop your English English academic skills specifically for your courses in the Faculty of Arts. So I'm going to talk about each of these courses now in a little bit of detail. So the core university English course, uh, in this course you'll develop language skills needed for essay and report writing and tutorial discussion skills. These are the major uh, assessment types that you will have to complete for the Common Core curriculum. You'll also develop academic grammar and vocabulary, and you'll also interact with students from other faculties in this course. And then in year two, you'll take an English in the Discipline course, and there are six of these courses, and you'll see that these six courses relate to the, to the majors in the Faculty of Arts. So in these six courses, you'll be developing on writing skills through reading in your discipline. In the course, you'll be given a high degree of choice in what you will read and write about. So we hope that you will be choosing something to read and to write about that has uh, a lot of interest for you. Uh, but uh, you'll need to make sure that you choose the right course for the discipline that you're most interested in. So not only those uh, courses uh, we offer, but at CAS we also offer support services on campus. So these support services help you develop your academic English skills. Um, they also uh, help you develop your professional English skills. Uh, this will be English skills for the workplace and also English skills for applying for a job. So things like CV writing skills and also uh, social English skills. So, for example, if you want to improve your, your social uh, spoken English, we provide venues for you to get together with other students and chat in English. All right, all of these services are called the CAS Communication Support Services or CSS. So there are four units within CSS. Um, the Digital Literacy Lab is one. Uh, so this lab can help you if you have, for example, a video assessment to complete. Uh, if you have a writing assessment to complete, you can go to the Writing Centre. If, if you have to do a tutorial uh, discussion assessment or an oral presentation, then the Speaking Studio can help you. And if you just want to talk to someone about more longer term language uh, development, then you can go to General Language Advising. Uh, the CSS also offers English discussions and workshops. 
Uh, there are many of these. Uh, discussions might uh, revolve around current affairs, politics, arts and culture. Uh, you may be um, able to practice your debate and tutorial discussion skills. And then workshops uh, might be around language assessments, uh, for example, IELTS, um, helping you with CVs, cover letters, interview skills, or uh, workshops on pronunciation, or workshop, workshops on presentation skills. There are many of these. We also run a experiential learning course that students can take in the summer. This is a credit bearing course. And in this course, we take students to uh, Myanmar to uh, teach English. And um, this is a very rewarding course and some uh, course that students find very valuable. So uh, that gives you an overview of the services and the courses that are run by CAS. So we really look forward to supporting you in the development of your academic English and uh, we hope to see you soon. CAS 1000 Core University English is a general academic English course offered by the Centre for Applied English Studies. It's a stepping stone from secondary school English to university English and helps students to use English more effectively in their first year studies at Hong Kong U. Taking the CAES uh, 1000 course is like very useful for me. Firstly, which has really, really impacted my writing is thesis statements because uh, it allows the reader to follow your chain of thought and it's a lot more structured. How to write an essay, um, how to structure an essay, how to avoid grammatical mistakes and how to present my ideas really objectively, which is also very, very important. To be able to develop a stance and to be able to critically argue about that stance, not just while writing, but while speaking in a discussion as well. I knew how to positively contribute to group discussions. I knew how to confidently take part in them, which helped me not just for this one course, but all my other courses, because all of them have tutorials and group discussions. The effective notes taking. It's very useful for me to like organize my notes and to try to drop down the most important uh, things for me to do my revision and for my presentation. Before I took this course, I didn't really know how to do APA citations, and so it was all completely new for me. But I can you know, confidently say that right after learning these uh, citations, I've almost immediately applied these skills to my other Common Core courses and even some of my disciplinary core courses. When I first joined uh, the University of Hong Kong, I was given the option of exempting myself from CAES 1000, but I'm so glad that I didn't. As, as a student who took uh, CUE in the second semester of my first year, I did notice the stark difference between my writing in uh, semester one and semester two. This course gave them the foundation and also the strong cornerstone for them to not to commit any mistakes that might ruin or put their academic life at stake. CAES 1000 course is a very fun course for me, I think. The CAES program, unlike other courses, they actually encourages students to interact and discuss with each other. This course is sort of like an introductory English course to ease students into writing academically in university, except these skills are basically useful for the rest of your university career. And so, yeah, this is why I think every year one student should take this course. Because what you learn at CAS 1000 will not only help you for these four years in HKU, but also for the rest of your life.